Kirov, I'm a research entomologist, beekeeper and teacher. And today's stream is devoted to entomology science. What means entomology? Entomology is a science devoted to insects, sometimes including some aspects of another invertebrates like mites, arachnids, ticks, and so on. But mostly about insects, about their influence on a human life and on the life of a whole planet. Entomology includes different aspects of studying insects and some other invertebrates, like agricultural entomology, plant protection entomology, fu fundamental entomology, morphology, ecology, anatomy. Of course, arachnology, this is a separate part, a part of entomology. But nevertheless, if just a few numbers of researchers are studying arachnology, they're involved in the activities of entomologists as well. So, entomology is devoted to agriculture, forensic entomology, urban entomology, and other aspects of entomology, right? And I'm talking about entomology in English to wide audience of this channel, because this channel is watching from all countries all around the world, including English-speaking countries. And it's very good, because we are living in democratic society. And our researchers, scientists, entomologists, were studying insects and other invertebrates and were publishing papers, scientific articles, in different journals, in books, in proceedings of congresses and conferences. Of course, our Ukrainian scientists published abroad, in American and European journals. But nevertheless, we have also our local journals, Ukrainian journals. So today I will announce new issue of our journal of Ukrainian entomology. We have electronic journal which is named Ukrainian Fau Entomof Entomofaunistics, which is just completely just set up on the website of Ukrainian Entomological Society, which includes different cities and scientists from all around the Ukraine and some from abroad. And we have second journal devoted to Ukrainian entomology and other aspects of entomology worldwide. This is Ukrainian Entomological Journal. And I am pleased to keep it in my hands, several issues of this journal. These are journals published, okay, in 2019, 2018. And this is a new journal, just recently published in the end of this year. 2023. And this is issue 21, 21st issue of Ukrainian Entomological Journal. So I'm very pleased to make a just short review of publications inside these journals. We are publishing articles in this journal devoted to entomology and arachnology in English and in Ukrainian language. And first of all, I should say that this journal just published recently, despite all these military conditions in Ukraine. And this journal is devoted to the memory of our famous Ukrainian entomologist Alexander Puchkov, who passed away in 2021, a few years ago, and who was our colleague and who studied carab carabide and cicindelide beetles, taxonomy, biodiversity, and practical influence of these insects in agricultural entomology. And several pa papers here, several articles devoted to his job, to his activities. And I will tell you short review of these articles and others as well. First article, authors Babitsky and Cherney, devoted to scientific fundamental collections, stock collections of Institute of Zoology of National Academy of Sciences. And this general review, which was done by Alexander Puchkov as a chief of laboratory of stock collections. This is a review of scientific methods which were developed by Alexander Puchkov regarding stock collections. We have very nice stock collections. This is the first article. 
Authors Babitsky and Cherney. So this is about job which was done by Alexander Puchkov, including different publications, formation and accounting of collections of all invertebrates and inclusions from ambers, and formation of list of scientific zoological collections of our Schmangausen Institute of Zoology and National Academy of Sciences. Second article with authors Cherney and Nazarenko. This is full list, short review and full list of publications. We review for these publications, which were done by Alexander Puchkov, our colleague, our entomologist who was working in Institute of Zoology for dozens of years. And this issue is devoted to his memory. This article contains a list, full list of 200 81 scientific publications of Doctor of Biological Sciences Alexander Puchkov, which were concerning to the geography, taxonomy, phylogeny, and ecology of ground beetles of a family Carobidae and tiger beetles of family Cisendelidae of a world fauna. Third publications in this journal. Of authors Puchkov, Babitsky, Cherney, and Furso. Quite a big publications, and it's named Scientific Collections of the Schmalgausen Institute of Zoology of National Academy of Sciences of Ukraine. With all review of different groups and different collections in our institute. It's surprising to say how big collections we have in our Institute of Zoology of National Academy of Sciences in Kiev. All samples in Institute of Zoology includes 6,800,000 units of storage, which are united in 684 collections, and they are deposited in scientific collections of the Institute of Zoology in Kiev. How many animals, how many are represented over there? 3,400 animal species, which are belonging to 8,400 genera, 96 orders and 20 classes, and 8 phyla are represented in 626 systematical collections in the Institute of Zoology of National Academy of Sciences. About 22,000 specimens are representing the type specimens, holotypes, paratypes, lectotypes, which are belonging to 4,200 animal species, and holotypes of 1,300 79 species are kept in the collections of Institute of Zoology in Kiev. It's just about 16,000 animal species deposited in scientific collections are only partially identified to different taxonomical levels due to the, the archival storage. So huge Huge systematical and taxonomical collections are represented in the Institute of Zoology of National Academy of Sciences in Kyiv, Ukraine. They are deposited, stored, and under the systematical taxonomical study now. Next paper of authors Zerova, Fursov, Klim Klimenko, which is named Nomenclature, Redescription and distribution of species Calcid wasp, Phylohera madera, belonging to the family Eurytamidae. This article, including redescription and taxonomical discussion of this species of Calcid wasp, 
which is living in different regions of Palearctical region. List is presented in the article, different countries and areas of Palearctic. It's interesting that this species, this is a Phytophagus species, which is living in, and larvae of this species living inside stems of different grasses like fringe brome, wild rye, barley, and wheat. So in, in some years, about 100 years ago, this was very important pest of some wheat fields. But now it's found only in collections and in the wild areas in different countries, like in Ukraine, in Turkish Republic, and other countries. This paper was published in English. Next article in this journal of Ukrainian Entomological Society. Next article, author is Nerush, which is young entomologist, just student of university. The name of article, round beetles of a Holosiv's forest of city of Kiev. As a, this is a result of study, taxonomical study of ground beetles of a family, Carabidae, and it was found 120 species belonging to 70 subgenera, 40 genera, and 10 subfamilies, which are re were represented in the studied areas. This is a Colossiv, this is a special forest in the city of Kiev. Very interesting and very careful study and with very careful taxonomical list of all species represented nearly not in the center, but in, in environmental urbans of city of Kiev. Next article with authors Cherny, Nadvorny, Nadvorny, Nazarenko, Orlov, Babitsky, Besmertna, Zabludovska, and Bukatka. The title of article is about mass reproduction of bark beetles of a family, Curculanidae, subfamily Scolitine, which are causing the death of coniferous in Ukraine, and methods of protection of pine seedlings of a species, Pinus sylvestris, in Ukrainian Carpathians. This is a study was done during several years by the group of authors. This publication includes description of method of collecting investigations, photos of these pests, bark beetles, not in one black, but in color pictures, damages of bark, of wood, It's described here, and methods how to control this species. And the last but not the least, the article devoted to our recent meeting of a non-governmental civil organization of Ukrainian Entomological Society, about 10th Congress of Ukrainian Entomological Society, which was organized on the 2nd to 6th October of 2023 in Kyiv. And it was took part on the base of Institute of Plant Protection of National Agrarian Academy of Sciences. Uh, this meeting was very large. Proceedings was published. I have showed them already. I can show them as well. Sorry about this noise. Some proceedings of this meeting were published. This is materials, abstracts of presentations which were done. Members of Ukrainian Entomological Society during this meeting in October 2023. Yes. About 150 entomologists from 59 scientific and 
scientific institutes and universities took part in this congress from different, not only from Ukraine, but from 10 organizations of other countries as well, from Moldova, Poland, Slovakia, Slovak Republic, Germany, Portugal, Spain, Finland, United States, and Estonia. And even one participant from was from Ukrainian Antarctic Station academician Vernatsky. He was also a biologist and entomologist. He participated in this Congress distantly. Most important results are described here in this review for this article. This was a photo of participants, some part, just a part of participants near the Institute of Plant Protection in Kiev in October. Congress was organized as following 10th Congress of Ukrainian Entomology Society after the period 2018-2023, every, every five years, for sure, as normal situation, despite all our current difficult military conditions in Ukraine. Representatives of 12 cities and districts were presented at this Congress. All reports, all reports were done on different sections of general entomology, archaeology and arachnology, section of agricultural entomology, section of biological control and of plant protection, and on the section of forestry entomology. It was done just general report of a former president of Ukrainian Entomological Society, Dr. Fedorenko, a new president of Ukrainian Entomological Society, Dr. Valery Karneev, was elected as a new president of Ukrainian Entomological Society. Former president was Valery Petrovich Fedorenko and current Valery Alexeyevich Korneyev. Here in just the Council of Ukrainian Entomological Society was elected and here also printed the list of all council, including all entomologists from different scientific organizations. Some rules and the reports and financial reports as well were published here as a result. So this is a short review of journal, and on the last page of this journal of Ukrainian Entomological Society, we have a photo of our sponsor, who is just our soldier of Ukrainian army, and who supported the publication of this journal financially. I do not show his photo for some security reasons. So this journal was published recently in the last days of December 2023. So we're meeting now just in our institute as entomologists, as scientists and researchers uh, and studying our subjects, entomological su subjects and others at the Institute of Zoology. So we are continuing our job, our work, and I hope so that next issue of Ukrainian Entomological Society, issue of 22nd issue, will be published in 2024 as well during the next, next coming months. This is a short review of Entomological Society activities of some publications in our journals. And maybe I can continue this tradition to give re short reviews of some articles of Ukrainian Entomological Society. So maybe in my next issues or my next streams, I can give you some reports about articles which have been printed in other journals. 
in journals of Ukrainian entomological society, maybe in our journal Biodiversity, which is published in Institute of Zoology of National Academy of Sciences, and also maybe some other reviews of entomological literature from internet and from hard printed articles like this journal of Ukrainian entomological society. So I am inviting Ukrainian specialists and some foreign specialists from our countries who are supporting Ukraine, who are standing with Ukraine to be published in this journal in Ukrainian and in English as well. And thank you for your interest, for your activities. Write your comments, ask your questions. If you have questions about entomology, you are really welcome to write it under this, this video. And welcome to my channel devoted to entomology. Be keeping some educational activities devoted to the science in general. And you can see many other videos about entomology and about science on my page of YouTube channel. Thank you for watching. Thank you for sponsorship, our soldier of Ukrainian army, who is just here presented in this journal. And looking forward to see you on my channel in my next issues of streams. And welcome to watch my other videos as I have recorded videos on my channel. Good luck and see you soon on my channel. Don't forget to subscribe and press like and write your comments. Subscribe and press like. Good luck. Thank you for